Hi all. So an elderly patient presented with a mass in the nasopharynx. As you can see, this is the mass in the nasopharynx. As we know that we need to rule out malignancy and for which imaging is necessary. This is an MRI T1 with gadolinium contrast transverse section. Blood vessels, tumors, inflammatory tissues, they take up the contrast. This is the lesion corresponding to the clinical relevant site. One of the most crucial landmarks in nasopharynx is the fossa of Rosenmuller, which lies posterior to the torus tuberis. That's the fossa of Rosenmuller. The nasopharyngeal carcinoma most commonly arises from that. So if there is a cancer or any lesion arising from that, that particular space will get obliterated. And hence, even the eustachian tube can have some dysfunction and also the middle ear. Now, this fossa of Rosenmuller was named after German anatomist Johann Christian Rosenmuller. Thank you for listening.